Hey everyone, it's Carol over at MommyWantsFreebies.com and this is a tutorial on how to make one of these. This is, uh, a lot of people call it a timeout bottle or a calm bottle. My daughter calls it a fairy bottle. Um, basically, it, the whole premise behind it is when you put your child in timeout, you give them this bottle and it's full of glitter and a few other things in there. And once it's all settled down to the bottom, you can kind of start seeing it settle there, they're out of timeout. And the whole reasoning behind this is not just a timer, it's so that they can sit and watch it and calm down because we know that when we put a child in timeout, they're usually pretty crazy. So um, it gets them to calm down. It also gets them to start thinking about what they, why they're in timeout and what they did that was naughty. Um, I wanted to make sure to let you know that this was not my idea. This is an idea that I saw on Pinterest and it looks like it originated to mycrazyblessedlife.com. So be sure to check out her website. Um, she's got a great site and lots of great things. So um, that's where it came from, not from me, but I just wanted to show you all how to do it. So what you need is a bottle. This is a tall cylindrical bottle. I, it's, uh, I think this one was from Smart Water, but you can use anything like this that is pretty clear and the cylindrical ones work really well for um, the glitter settling. You can use one of these if you wanted something smaller, but I don't like the ridges and it's also pretty pliable. The um, plastic is pretty thin, so it makes a lot of noise. Uh, I just, I prefer this one. It holds up better. You'll also want to have some Aileen's Clear Gel Tacky Glue. Um, the clear is very important. You do not want to use the white glue or else it will make the bottle all milky and nothing will settle right. You'll also need some glitter. This here is a glitter, it's a five compartment glitter it looks like, oh, four compartment glitter. Or you can use these little tubes. You just want to make sure it's a fine glitter. You don't want to use um, a thick glitter or else it won't settle to the bottom. And then this is an optional here. This is glitter glue. Again, you want clear. You'll also want some super glue so you can glue the top on the bottle. And then something else that's optional is just little pieces of um, confetti, just a little plastic confetti. I like to put them in the bottles and tell my children to look for the stars or the hearts or whatever is in there. So um, there's that. Everything that you'll use today, you'll find at Joanne Fabrics or Michaels or Hobby Lobby or any of those other um, craft type places. You can probably even find it at Walmart. So what you want to do is you want to take the um, top off and make sure that it's filled with about three quarters of water. Um, something room temperature, don't use cold. And then you'll also want to take the top off of your tacky glue. And you're gonna put about half of this bottle in here, um, depending on how long you want it to take to settle. So I just use it like this. It'll come down in a second and just pour it straight in rather than using the little tubey thing that it comes in. So I'm going to put a little bit more. Just a little bit more. There we go. So you'll see that it's, it's starting to go in there. You can kind of see it a little bit. And then you want to take your glitter. Uh, I'm going to use blue today. I'm going to make a blue bottle for my son. And for these usually use about a full thing of this um, or you can mix it but uh, make sure that the colors are contrasting or else it looks muddy. Um, I like to use the same color throughout so I'm gonna pour a whole bunch of this in there just like that and if you wanted to use this you can I'm not sure how much I have left in here just use a couple dollops of that there we go. And then you want to shake it up. You want to shake it up really well to get all of the glue and the gel and all of that to um, disperse and go through. Ta-da! So pretty. Do it a little bit more. There we go. And um, you'll also want to time it. Uh, if it's settling too fast, add more of this glue. If it's not settling fast enough, add more water. So, and that's it. That's how you make it. You just want to um, glue the top down with some super glue so that your child can't open it. 
because that would be a horrible mess. And um, that's, that's how you do it. So now my son's got one and my daughter's got one. So we are ready for time out. <laughs> so there you have it. So mesmerizing. I think I want to make one for myself. And for more frugal tips, couponing, recipes, and crafts, be sure to check out mommywantsfreebies.com. Um, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Facebook, and Twitter. And I wanted to give a special thanks to mycrazyblessedlife.com for this really great idea. My kids love it, and I hope yours do too. Um, <laughs> <laughs>